Good morning, Baldwin. My name is Jessica Kischweger and I'm here with Tatjana Vukovic, Lisa Meyer and Hannah Meliger. Today is Friday, the April 7th and here are our morning announcements. The impossible question is, 45% of drivers either currently have this or have had it in the past. What is it? Stay tuned to find out. Attention juniors, if you are considering college after high school or are unsure of our goals, it is highly advised that you take this SAT May 6th here at Baldwin High School. The registration deadline is this Saturday. This is a great opportunity to prepare for the next step after high school and is highly encouraged for the majority of juniors to take one time. Thank you to those ball winners who donated the blood drive on Wednesday and Thursday. The Central Blood Bank said on Wednesday we donated 30 units of whole blood and 4 units of blood bags. We made a significant impact in the one day by supporting the of 102 patients. Now over to Lisa for the weather. Lisa. The weather today is snowy with a high of 33 and a low of 31. Tomorrow it's, it will be badly cloudy with a high of 57 and a low of 38. Now over to Tatjana at the desk. Tatjana? Thanks, Lisa. Baldwin High School seniors who will be attending a college or university this fall may be enter a contest to win a one-time 2,500 scholarship for one male student and one female student. To apply, pick up an application form in the athletic office and return no later than April the 30th. Now, how? Now over to Hannah for the sports news of the day. Hannah. Thanks, Tatiana. Any senior athlete who has participated in the varsity sports team in the school, you will be awarded a senior athletic park at the all school at the all sports senior banquet on Sunday, May 21st. Athletes must complete a form for the printing of the nameplate. Senior athletic park forms are available in the athletic office. Return to the completed form to the athletic office by April 25th. First, the girls' varsity and JV softball teams play tonight at 4 and 5.30 against Canon McMillian. Next, the varsity and JV boys' baseball teams play at 4.15 against Mount Lebanon. Finally, the boys' varsity lacrosse team plays against the North Hills at 7.30. That's all the sports news of the day. Now back over Jessica for the rest of the announcements. Jessica? Thanks, Hannah. The main course lunch is country fried pork chop with a side of fries and your choice of milk. The weird holiday is caramel popcorn day. The answer to the impossible question of 45% of drivers either currently have this or have had it in the past. A baby on board sign. That's all for the morning announcement. Have a great day, Baldwin. This is for you, I didn't talk for a long time. The boy liked things to always be the same. Any changes would scare and upset him. The unknown was an unfriendly place. The boy was very sensitive to lights and sounds. So he built secret hiding places where they couldn't get in. The boy didn't like looking people in the eye. He wasn't trying to be mean, it just made him feel uncomfortable. Sometimes he would flap his arms again and again. One day I found out I have something called autism. My family got me help. Slowly I found my voice and learned all the ways I could live with it better. Early intervention can make a lifetime of difference. Learn the signs at autismspeaks.org. Catch me up on the 